The lot had been ready for about a week before activity began again. It was the weekend, and that's when the plumber appeared. I learned that the rock in the ground was way too thick and that the angle of the pipe from the proposed basement bathroom to the basement pump was going to be at a less than desirable, but workable angle. I could tell that the site was presenting problems that required his full concentration, so I decided not to fly again. He was marking with chalk where the pipes were going to be installed before the slab was poured over. I learned that the site was prepared too low and that in order for the pump to be installed, a mold would have to be placed around the hole for the basement slab pour. With the foundation walls in place, then came the process of backfilling the dirt. A skid steer was used to bring the pre-piled dirt back to the foundation to fill in the spaces. I put my drone into the air to film, and it was evident right off the bat that I needed to work on my skills. I first started with the simple skill of flying in a rotation around the skid steer and trying to keep the skid steer in view. I then began to tilt the camera up and down. At my level of expertise, I was basically hovering the drone and filming from about 75 to 100 feet. Where the basement slab was to be poured, the rocks were being removed and it was being leveled. After the lot was leveled, the gravel was being spread to get ready for the pour. The gravel was in place in squared sections. They were really careful not to disturb the plumbing pipes. Then they laid a moisture barrier over and installed the rebar ready for the pour. The basement slab was ready to be poured. <laughs>